The tiny delta town of Konjangong honors a native son. Local residents erect a billboard bearing the image of the country's newly elected president, Tinjo. The soft-spoken 69-year-old is the son of a revered poet and a longtime confidant of National League for Democracy's party leader Aung San Suu Kyi. On Tuesday, Tinjo won 360 of 652 votes in parliament and will take over from incumbent Thane Sein on April the 1st. He's the first leader without a military background to take power in Myanmar in more than five decades. We all want to see uh, Aung San Suu Kyi be the uh, president, but so far, so it is not uh, in reality yet. But uh, we shall have the uh, like very good uh, president, uh, Uten Choi. So we believe him. So I feel very special today. Chen Jo's road to victory was paved by Aung San Suu Kyi. Her NLD party won parliamentary elections last November in a landslide. This will be recorded as a first in history. I'm really satisfied with the achievements of Auntie Su and the NLD. Su Kyi was excluded from the presidency because of a constitutional clause created by the former military junta, which bars anyone with a foreign spouse or child from eligibility. Aung San Suu Kyi, whose two sons are British, vowed to lead anyway as a proxy president. The military junta had ruled Myanmar since a coup in 1962. While this election marks a clear transition towards democracy and civilian rule, the military still holds power over three ministries and 25% of seats in parliament.